Hey, this is Trevor Horn with B Varsity, and we are here with Marcus Moda, the sophomore from Stockdale, who was our 2016 Boys Cross Country Runner of the Year. Marcus, congratulations to you. How much fun was this year, man? Uh, this year I had a blast. I I got a, I got to travel a lot, a lot of places. I met a lot of people, and I just got to run in a lot of different races. And that's the thing. You were all across the state. Uh, talk to us about some of those races and what those races meant to you and win or lose, how much better you got as a runner because of them. Oh, well, the first major race I've ever been in was Woodbridge, and wow, that was that was a spectacular race because – Ran with big names, a lot of people, very fast race, which pushed me to like give my best and as best as I can. And that really prepared me mentally for the season because that put a little fire into my heart and it just made me want to train harder and get better and go from wherever I was to I want to be the best. That's where I wanted to be. And obviously some of the best in Central Section history have come from Stockdale. Cameron Miller and obviously Blake Haney are two of the big names in recent years. Do you ever feel like you're running in the shadows of those two or are you running towards trying to be what those two were? Uh, I don't feel like I'm running in the shadows of them, but I definitely am trying to be at their level and further be further at their level. Uh, it's pretty hard to like be further at their level, but I'm trying to be like – I'm not trying to be them, but I'm trying to exceed farther and try to be my own self, make my own name. Last year you took fifth overall at Valley mm -hmm. as a freshman, an incredible feat. And I know that Cameron was one of the first to say how incredible a feat that was for you. And then this year you came into it and you finished second mm -hmm. behind Miguel Villar of Madera South. Do you take solace in the fact that you ran so hard in that race in such a tough competition, or is there more fuel for you to not be second next year? Next year, my goal is not to be second. Like, but this year, my goal was to be first. It, obviously, it didn't. It didn't happen. But I'm glad I got, I got to race him, and it was it was a very fun race because it was just me and him neck and neck the whole race until he pulled away, and it was just fun. And it wasn't just him that you were going against this year. You had some great rivalry here in Kern County itself. And I think the one person that stands out is Moises Madrana, who obviously is a good friend of yours, someone mm -hmm. that you two have a good friendly rivalry uh, between. The two of you you're going to go into next year as two of the top runners in the central section once again. Is there a good rivalry that you guys have in cross country that goes into track that stays within, off of, you know, away from the two sports that you guys have personally and that fuels the two of you, you think? Uh I mean, we always kind of try to, like, talk about, like, getting together and running with each other. But whenever, like, we race, we always, like, kind of joke around and, like, oh, yeah. And, like, but once we get on the side of the line, like, all bets are off. Like, friendship kind of gone, but, like, kind of there at the same time, if that makes sense. And it's just between me and him. Mostly, like, I always try to get him. But this year, this year yeah. 30th this year at the state competition, div mm -hmm. Division One level as a sophomore. Um how much did you take away from that race? I mean, obviously, last year as a freshman, you were kind of wide-eyed because it was the first time you were ever in a competition that big. Mm -hmm. This year, obviously, you had experience from last year. What did you take away from this year at State? Uh, I need to change my strategy a little bit more and maybe get, in put, a, get put into a little bit more bigger races, get that feel right. again. Because I only got the beginning of the year, that, that feel, and maybe more in the middle of the year. and yeah. Is that going to be something where you're going to start talking to your coach about getting to the event organizers, to the Rich Rodriguez's of the world, and say, hey, I want to be in the elite races. I want to challenge myself, win or lose. Exactly. That, that, that's where I want to be. Because uh, I always want to be in the biggest, the best competition races. So Because the, be the races with the best competition will put me – further into racing then. you've got all these medals around your chest right now if you could take away all of those first place medals for a medal at one of the top invitations is that a goal of yours yes that is a goal of me that is a goal of mine <laughs> <laughs> yeah. well marcus fantastic season this year obviously congratulations to you on our being our 2016 b varsity boys cross country the runner of the year and thanks for coming in congratulations thank you all right marcus moda